one right now. And if you didn't sign up for health insurance by December, you aren't out of luck just yet. This year, the penalties for not signing up are prorated, meaning each month you'll have an opportunity to get in the marketplace. Jenna James joins us now with why some financial advisors say to get the health insurance regardless. Jenna, good morning. Good morning, Dave and Cerise. If you haven't signed up for health insurance, you could be facing some pretty steep fines per month. Now, right now, the minimum amount per person per month that you'd have to pay, $325. The maximum, $2,448. At that rate, you could afford a bronze level health insurance plan. So assuming it's cheaper to opt out isn't necessarily the best thing. That could be money out the window. And since so many of us have great computer researching skills, Vicki Vicky Overly says, put those to good use. I love it. I love that they're so computer savvy. They could get on there and look for a bronze level plan that would suit their needs and and help them um, to get into the marketplace and let's make this work we have to because there's no reason to pay a penalty that could go towards premiums now for january you have until the 17th to sign up for that health insurance then you'll pay for coverage each month rather than paying that penalty you will be able to opt in any month this year just make sure that you do that since next year those penalties will go up again so dave series opt in sooner rather than later yeah jenna last year there was a new form those on the marketplace had to file is there anything like that that's new this year last year you had to file that 1095a this year you need to get something like this it's a 1095c this you'll get from your employer all right, good to know. Jenna Jane's reporting this morning. Jenna, thank you.